uh, legend, Richard Ostrasana, how are you doing? I'm okay, yourself? I'm good. Uh, I want you to to talk about, I want us to talk about uh, Orlando Pirates uh, coming this season, looking at the way they, compared to last season and this season, the way they have been performing. Uh, what's your take on their performance? Well, to be honest, <laughs> and the findings that they made. <laughs> really, you know, if one have to be honest, you know, sometimes you you normally want to say something that will never sit well with other people. So we always restrain ourselves in saying those things. But uh, in terms of football wise, I think Parrot has been earmarked as the team that will have to challenge uh, Mamelodi Sundowns for the honors this season. And yes, of course, the complaint that they had in terms of playing Sterling Bosch, losing 1 0 over the weekend, but bouncing back, uh, winning 4 2 against uh, Sikukune. Real uh, so Real AM. I mean, that, that was a sign of them meaning business and their intentions were clear after losing 1 0 and bouncing back and scoring four goals. But yeah, considering two goals was not also good for them, but I think those are the areas that coach which will have to fix. Yeah, you were part of the team that won the KF Champions League for Orlando Pirates and you scored the winning goal for the Champions League. Mm -hmm. So, going for uh, Orlando Pirates... Okay, guys, so remember to come through Pirates on Saturday at 6 Looking at their squad, Reservoir what is your message Brown. to the guys? The opening ceremony As a will start at 9 a.m. Well, look, you're talking on about a team that has competed uh, almost this since since 95. Six They've six been in the Champions League more than five, six times. So I think the club knows what is needed and the players knows what is up on them in terms of performance. So there they, they won't be much advice to the players, but to go out there, make sure that they enjoy themselves. But the most important thing is the comorado that is needed when you're out of the country. You know how difficult it is in our continent, you know. So I think it, the more they group together, especially away from home, because that's where you need to get results. If you can't win a game, at least get a throw and make sure when you come home, that's where you've got your comfortability and you need to make sure that you, you get all the three points. Oh, the goal advantage needs to be yours because you're playing at home. So I think that can be the only advice to say when they are away, they need to group together, stand together and make sure that they fight together. Okay, thank you. Thank you.